Hello and welcome back to another ModiSoft back office video. My name is Jonathan. Today we'll be going over on how to add promotions in your ModiSoft back office. So promotions are going to be basically all the deals that you're giving away to your customers, such as whenever you buy two Gatorades for you know a couple dollars, or for your Marlboro promotions that you have with Altria where you buy two packs, get 50 cents off. So we're gonna show you how to create them, how to send them to the POS once they are created. In the top left corner, go to your main menu, go to products, promotions. And then on this page here, you will see you have to complete the three steps in order to create your promos. So first you're gonna to have to create your promo groups, then you're gonna to have to add the items to that group, and then you're gonna create your actual promotion where you're gonna assign the group to that promotion. So we'll start off first here. Um, gonna add a new record. So you're gonna create your group first. So this will be our promotion group that we're gonna be creating today. And then we will add items to that promotion group. So once you are on this page, you can search any way you want for your promotions, whether you want to search by scan codes, groups, descriptions, categories, manufacturers, etc. Um, for this specific demo, we're going to go ahead and go by a price group that we already have created here. So once you get your category set, you can select the items that are going to be a part of this promo, transfer them over to the right side, and then once you are done, just hit the back button here and then that will have added those items to that group so you'll see down here now your coke promo has those four items that you just added so now that you've created your group you just need to go up top and go to step number three so you can actually create the promotion so when you go to step three create mix and match so all you have to do to add a new one, just click here in the far right corner, add new promotion. And then you can create the promo any way you want. So for this example, we're gonna create a promotion buy two Cokes for $4. Then once you've created the description name, you can just search for your promotion group that you have. Now, if you are like some locations, you're gonna have a lot of promotion groups that you may have already created. Um, if you, and you can see in our list here that we do have a lot of groups. So we make it easier for you to search for that group since you already made a promo group, you can actually manually type in the name of the group. Makes it a lot easier to find that group instead of having to scroll down and search for that, that group that you created. Now this funded by is optional for scan data, but for this situation, you don't have to worry about it. And under the mix and match section here, you will see that you are given two options, new price or price reduction, if the customer buys a certain amount of quantity. So if you're doing a new price, basically it is stating that you're when the customer buys whatever quantity you enter here, so in this case it's two, if they buy, buy two items, they're gonna get a new price. So that is what we are doing here, new price. So if they buy two, they get it for $4. Now, if you went and did the price reduction, all this is gonna do, let's say you wanted to do a price reduction where if they buy two Cokes, they get 50 cents off you can actually put the 0.50 here. And this basically means how much is gonna come off your total price after everything is rung up. So when the customer buys those two Cokes, they'll get 50 cents off. But in this situation, we are gonna be doing the $4 price. Once you set that price, you can come down here and set your schedule. Now your schedule is gonna be for the time that it starts till the time that this promotion ends. Enter that here. And then if you are going to be adding this deal to C, if you have the C package in, purchased at your location, you can actually add an image, a description, and check mark here, add deal to C, so that you can add this promotion to C, and then your customers will be able to see 
this promotion whenever they are searching on the Cartsy app at your location. So at minimum, you just need to put here just the description, the mix and match, and schedule info. The stuff at the bottom for Cartsy is optional, so you do not have to enter anything here. Once you've entered the minimum required information, you're going to select the store or stores if you are a multi-store owner where you want this promotion to be active. So for this demo, we're going to be just doing it for this specific store and then just hit save and close. So once you save and close that, you'll see that your promotion has been added. You'll see that the status is OK. So that means this can be sent to the POS. And all you have to do now is send your promotion to the point of sale so that it can be rung up at your registers. So once you have your promotion added, you are going to go to your main menu at the top left corner, go to send a POS, and then you will see a promotions review. So in the promotions review, you again will see the same promotions. You just have to select the promotion or promotions that you are going to send to the POS. Now, since we only created this one promotion, we will only select this promo. And then we can just hit send promotion to POS. And then you will see once it is done at the top screen, it'll say items have been sent to the POS. So now you can give it a couple minutes. And now if you have a Modisoft point of sale, you can give it a couple minutes and then it will ring up eventually those two Cokes. When you scan them, it will scan for that discounted price. Passport, you just have to wait for that message that says price book has been updated. And for the commander, you just need to log out, log back in, and then you will be able to ring up this promotion. We hope that you found this guide useful in better understanding your Modisoft back office. Please like, subscribe, and click on the notification bell so that you will always be up to date on your Modisoft back office. Thank you and have a wonderful day.